All right, well, we have a little less than 30 minutes. Um, I'm going to say a couple of things. Um, then uh, Tony is going to introduce a couple of our master teachers or, uh, that are here uh, to make a few comments uh, around uh, their thoughts uh, around change management in particular. And then just warning to the panel, we'll then come to the panel and if each of you could give a few summary comments uh, as well. Though let, we do need to be sensitive to the time. So, you know, they always say writing a, or in, actually giving a short speech is harder than a longer one. So, um, make sure you're working on that. Uh, yeah, I, I thought this was fascinating. The, the, it's exciting to see the number of possibilities uh, that exist um, and the amount of work going on in so many different areas is just phenomenal. I guess putting my CEO hat on, and Bob and I are sitting at the same table here, and we were both whispering back and forth about this. This is a massive, massive, massive change management effort, right? Getting people to change what they do every day is hard, and it's particularly hard without necessarily a direct burning platform, right? Um, this has some parallels to also the reengineering efforts that happened in a lot of large companies uh, in the the 1990s, and one of the parallels, I guess Glenn kicked it off, I thought was fascinating, was saying that a lot of this isn't about automating what we do today, it's changing fundamentally what we need to do to be able to better teach in the context of the technology um, uh, uh, technologies that are available. And that was very, very similar to what happened with a lot of large companies in the 1990s, re-engineering fundamentally what they did um, within the context of what technology would allow them to do. And anyone who was at a large company in that period of time knows it was bloody and it was painful, right? There are massive consulting firms that got built just because of uh, these uh, efforts. Um, it is very, very difficult to change people's behaviors, and even more difficult, again, without a, a burning platform. So uh, I'm hoping we can also, and I hope that uh, our master teachers will, will spend a couple minutes addressing what they see as well as the change management issues. The technology's clearly made tremendous progress, but how we actually get from here to you know, people teaching different things differently, uh, it sounds like uh, just a huge, huge effort. And any thoughts around that from the panel as well, most appreciated. So with that, Tony, do you want to introduce the teachers?